Enyem Sadi na Enyem Sadi Them niece. Then, me yes. don't know. Two rich love the kids, them just take her as my pitney and my daughter. Because, you know, she look grand. She just full of peer life. I want you to say some things, it does. It does come out some way away. Uncle she alone could have make it sound so. So it's like, you know, to live in a social media era. We're always a fit. Bring cross. I don't know how I go on, you know, for not a billion, a billion, like a billion dollars to deal with them. My dear, I've come off and come on back. Uh, I never got yeah, there, there is a slight Stand delay. Man. There's a slight delay. Chris, are we, what are we doing? We're trying to see if we can sort out the connection. I don't know. I should do that. Oh, I didn't hear that. He says he's going to come off and come back on. Okay. All right, so while it, while it go, Richie, yeah. what you can do is yeah, go on, that. come off and come back on and we'll wait for you. Man, All right. So, so, um, Sandrina, while we wait on Richie to come back, I mean, as you are saying that Richie was dropping some gems a while ago. Definitely. <laughs> Definitely. And, um, and I see some people asking him to play music, but it's not that live yet. We have to have him back to juggle. But tonight, we really wanted to just talk to him about his fatherhood journey. Um, and we hope that we get to connect with him again in in short order as we're intrigued by the conversation actually right right because that that conversation and you know i mean what is he's talking about his children is exactly it's funny that you would have heard me quote um professor uh sam Zvon, um this and basically that's what um she was saying that um mm -hmm. There are fathers out there who are actually joining and taking care of their children. It's just that um, we are only hearing about the bad ones, you know, the bad eggs who are out there who are not necessarily doing what it is that they're supposed to be doing. And as Richie did say, we don't talk about the good ones. What we do is that we talk about the bad ones. All right, so um, here he is again. Yeah. Yes. Um, so I just um, bringing him in. Well, he has to restart the conversation about Peely because everybody wanted Peely. Yeah, so yeah, everybody wanted to hear about Peely. Yeah, everybody yeah. Want to hear about Peely. Right. So as soon as he pops back in, that's where we will pick yes. things up from. I just, um, I, yeah, I, I said yes. <laughs> I think I think you know, it's a, a slow is there's a delay on his side. Even though he says it's not his wife, I wonder if him hear me. <laughs> uh, hold on. Oh, how I feel a part two. I'm adding him, but him not coming yeah, in. There, there's an issue with the internet. Um, all right well, while we wait for richie to get back on for those we have some new audience members so good night this is the q &S club of friends across borders and we're blessed to be talking with richie feelings thanks so much sir for hopping off and coming back on everybody wanted to start over back about peely because they never hear and they're, they're interested to hear the backstory. So let's start the conversation again about um, Sweet Little Peely. 
Okay, well, who don't know, Pele is not my real daughter, but is my daughter, right? And she's my kids, them niece. So automatically, I'm a pitney. I had feel it for from she was three. Mm. So she have her mother and her father. Mm -hmm. Right? She have a lot of family. But mm. men are have this attachment where it's like only a father or a caring parent could have that bond. They take her to school, me and her sleep at night time. Um, it works. We go out from vacation together. She deal with more kid. Care of her spa. She go do her little kids spa or something. So, if you don't love children, you're not going to be able to do things like that. Because a lot of men and women only love their kids. Right. So them not say them not love nobody else's kids. Them not love nobody else's children. While you have some man don't love their kids and them love somebody else's kid. How that happen? I think it have a lot to do with brainwashing from one of the parents. You understand? Because some people say, um, then they don't with no step pitney while you have some people say step pitney is the best fit them pitney are crosses fit them pitney are dislike some like we hear everything because they don't know what they in the world and what they on the internet so things with me might go through with my youth them other people might not have that yes you understand like all of what i all of what i do with my kids then it's a joy to me other people can have it, but some choose not to have it. Because many people don't want to sacrifice. And after the youth, them reach a certain age, people feel like, say, your time that they're a big man and they're a big woman. No, I can't run with no pitney and I can't. I don't want to nobody life. Zane? So, yeah. it does all depends on what you as a person want to do. It's like one time you know, hear some man say, boy, they moved in there with a woman who have children already. So, never have none of them thinking there. I'm really? thinking different. Somebody said, I think Peely was your mother. And we know she's very outspoken and brilliant. It's trouble them, trouble in there. Don't, don't, let them, don't, don't let them draw you out on this platform. But you know what I want to ask you? I spent a lot of time looking at the food, right? And I have to know if you were always... You always had that skill because I know, I know you're know tough with, or you had to learn it after, you know, you're dealing with, you know, with the kids or you just didn't know, say it, but it's a bad chef from a long time. Well, me and I'm a big chef, you know, I help myself. Yes. Right? I can help myself. And sometimes it takes you to be by yourself to learn to do things for yourself. Because mm -hmm. sometimes we have a lot of people around. We don't get used to doing nothing for ourselves. Other people doing things for us. And we get dependent on people. But we depend on people to cook for food. We depend on people to wash for clothes. So if people don't wash for clothes, we vex. If people don't cook with food, we vex. But when you're there by yourself, you spend some time to get to know yourself. And you say, okay, we can do this. Because sometimes we can do the things even though we are not professional. Yeah. Professionals, we, don't, we, we know we can, we can do it. Because, of course, a couple of times, well, we have to say we have tried the french fried chicken and we don't do it good and we have to end up and cook it down. Because we never put enough oil in the pot. We got through that already. So, kitchen malfunction. You understand? Rice burn up and the, I will put too much water in it and the rice soft and plaka plaka. I will not know say 
You understand? Nothing not perfect, but you have to try. That's why I don't like the word can. You can't say, oh, I can't do that unless you try. Mm -hmm. You understand? You have to try. And a lot of people live for please people. When I say live for please people, they worry about validation. And I remember one time, my daughter got to Queens and she was the pretty head girl. But to me, I always go for her. I always go for her, everything her father, her father. Because me, want to do it. So mm -hmm. she get used to me. So when me have to travel, she always have issue when she have to take the bus. So like one day, she have to take the bus. And she has to boy, I miss my father. And they must have everything of your father, your father, your father. God, them not have that with them father. Them not have that with them, with them father, but you have to understand. And then, when me come and I carry a home, the same girl, them where they go take the bus, and them ask me to drop them off them location. Remember, you know, so, me look upon that and say, sometimes people just have a jealousy over things, and wish they had that. So them cuss, and fight and go on over things where I go on good for you. Yes. You hearing me still, Richie? You know what I mean? I hear you. You hear know, your sister on my phone? Must be. Must be mine. So, if you are, if the, the stock. So internet still remember I'm something you know. That may say. Now nah, all the while it's um, ever perfect. Mm-hmm. As long as we as long as those who are watching are hearing you. So guys I'm let me know if you're hearing you. Richie. You are you Richie, Richie feelings, they say it's me, is the problem tonight. Is that what he's saying? <laughs> but if I'm not broken now. Where's the boy, Richie feelings? We say they say it's me, is the problem. Is me, Richie says the problem, everybody? Or them say, wait, what them say? Yeah. Oh, I can't. <laughs> Delay again, Richie, if you can hear me, because I'm not hearing you. Um, and I'm trying to make sure. Hardly. Looks like it's not me, don't it? Because I'm still here. Yeah, if that keep <laughs> yeah, yeah, so on. You see other people say one person say a flow, which I use. That's why. Richard, Richard followers them full of spice. <laughs> follows them full of spice tonight. Um, we we literally are heading up on our little one hour mark. So I'm sure we'll try to make sure that we uh work out another time with Richie to have the to finish the conversation. Um, but it has been so great just hearing him sharing his fatherhood journey, dropping some real gems to the fathers and mothers who are, who are online tonight, reminding us that please be richy, please be richy, because we can't end the time without you. Sir, I'm shutting up. Tell the, tell the fathers them what you need to tell them. Tell the mothers what you need to tell them um, as it relates I've to playing an important role in this as well. I've got to train you up for doing interview in a car. When you car, you know what <laughs> You understand? You don't really know what to do interview. But I will practice, not... sir. I will practice. Go ahead, sir. I'll practice. You don't really, you don't really, you don't really understand what I'm going but it's all right. The internet is doing justice right now. The internet is mm -hmm. trying to mash up everything. And that is fine. Because talking topics like this, tech, you need more than an hour to talk. Because we have a whole heap of things to talk. Well, the role as a father. One thing, you have to always ready for sacrifice for the youth. All the time, your baby mother. 
go give her the thing for you. You have to always remember, don't use the ignorance and make decisions. And you have to remember, so you have to deal child is able to help them. Because a whole lot of times, people go step out and the people get ah. All of the bird now, nah. the people not get no lunch, not get no attention, the people not get nothing nah. hard. Mother can't sit there, mother and she, anyway. Yeah, mother, I said, come ask you for things for the youth. And the first thing that they say, want to our man breed her and give a child are you. See? So what I say is, we have to put ego aside and deal with the youth. I always remember, say, it's all about the youth, regardless of how the situation want to come out, or it want to look, or it want to seem. I always remember. The child come first. Giving the youth money alone is not all. You need to know what's going on in the youth, them life. You just give the youth a big game. You just give the tablet. You just give the youth a phone. You just give the youth money in their pocket. But you don't really know what's going on with the youth at school. Or him stay academically. You don't know where the youth are going with academically. You don't know where they're going at school. Because remember, you know, true, we not so bright. We feel like say we use them now for so bright. We use them for brighter than we. We use them supposed to be brighter than we. You know, we are our youth not supposed to be on the same level because we live in a different time. We born 1970 something. And them come out born 2000 something. You understand? And 1990 yeah. something. And you understand? So people must always stop stigmatizing. Or something that mothers must stop getting oh me have her when me are 14 so I don't know if she get pregnant 20 times me have 15 when she are 15 them really need for dash way too much carelessness are going too much carelessness are going not because you're careless that means you can't. them stigmatize and say select have one bag of pick me and select a careless and sore and select everything them can't put me and uh, 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 in, in the moment we can talk come on you them teach I know me. All of you know me. When my youth are away, the whole of Queens know me. The security of the gate, me. A Queens. Every morning, I just say, I go through the gate. Every afternoon, just say, I come back. Me. My dad went there. My daughter do the extra curriculum, them. And the whole of the something, them. So everybody know me. And I like to say, I just go up there and this come. The way me go to the school, them, them ask if she not have no mother. Where's our mother? And I'm at a day. But me want to go. Me want to play my part when time report there. I have to see 10, 11, 12 teacher. Remember them see me up there till my favor up there. And I remember say, when you go to school, you're not supposed to go with a heavy heart and I want to go. Where am I going to tell me about my picnic now? Because remember, you know, yeah, you you supposed to have a reason and you come to you first. You're not supposed to be afraid to come to you. Yes, when you talk to the project, you know, your voice supposed to know, say, don't play. You understand? But yeah, you, you have to learn how to be with you, with them friend, and how to be as different. See? Yes. Because enough man always want to be a parent. And who me and a pity now being a friend, or you're going to know, you gonna know about your youth. When strangers see a road until I say, eh. Hey, I go up on a red and a wine and a bubbling and a go down, you know. And you go say, who oh, not my daughter, eh? You know, because you never know say your daughter like dancing. You never know. So your daughter or your son could have football because you have him and never know say he can play ball and he love ball. You never know what kind of sports you would like. You don't know if he like play piano, you know, like, like you, don't, you don't know what he like. So I forget to know to be with you, them friends. You would suppose feel comfortable a reason like mommy something is bothering me or daddy you know say this is bothering me and I don't like something that you do remember right. we do enough things for you them not like and we have to always remember say for respect you youth them enough time we come up on the internet do not say certain things because we know say we you them I watch I mean represent my youth them worldwide so I'm not going to embarrass myself and know say I'm going to embarrass my youth I mean, I have a company in the internet come in a cask, I mean, no, so my youth have to face the public. I mean, mm -hmm. I do that. Enough people just get up and just do whatever they want to do, and them and them people in a Anna and in a one bag and mix up and cask, eat on the internet. I mean, I will do that. I will never embarrass my youth. 
never, ever, 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 my youth will never get embarrassed. More than embarrass yourself to save them. More than me, I embarrass myself and them. Yes. You understand? So that's the big sacrifice, right? So you choose yourself over the youth. Then. Or what? Which, what, what are you going to do? Your youth want a kidney right now. You have a youth a kidney and you have to think about it to a kidney. Eh? You have to, because the next thing, you know, parents, not parents, I send youth to school for youth, them pass the rest for come to take care of them. Yeah. I youth them can't take care of me. Because I'm done, I can't take care of myself already. Them supposed to grow up to come take care of themselves and live better than me. You understand? And yes, say that again, that's Richie. Over. Somebody yeah. asked you to say that again. You have children? <laughs> yes. You have any children? I have a son, he's twelve. In Sardin? I have a son, he's twelve. <laughs> yeah, you hear me? Yes, Sardin is hearing you. I have yeah, a son, yeah. he's twelve. <laughs> Should I hear me? But go watch the messenger. Just listen to the message then. I'm done so I go on already. All I wanna You know you're not what I say. So your phone a delay like So you text a long answer. I may ask you one question. And you can't you can't tell me about you can't ask me about parenting. I alright, alright, big twelve. Me hear all of that. Nobody want me. But I start to ask a question and I have to walk through now. People, people don't know how I go on, but, but two phone now nah, connect. They much trouble off away. Good conversation. I said them always match for you. But anyway. Big up all of the good mother of them and the good father of them and the people them who are the co-parenting because we Jamaicans come like we don't know how to co-parent. So we're bitter over, over, over our ex. Bitter. Already like, for a minute, yo, tell the boy them, make sure they don't touch you, you know. Yo, tell the, yo, tell the girl, tell the make sure this and make sure she not do that, you know. You know what I mean? And Things like that, but when I tell you, say you have to make sure that the youth them come first at all. You can't help themselves, and not because the youth them just graduate from saying, Yes, they're going to earn a salary now. You feel like you forget our fight, and then they start telling the them, Say how much money you spend on them, and that, and it, and if them can't pay your back, and red, red, red. Like, well, I can send them go to school for the 10 years when them go to school, or the 15 years when them go to school, because as them. Get paid, they must come give you the whole light. So you don't expect them to have nothing. You just expect them to take care of you. So when they mother take care of themselves, mm -hmm. when they mother do things for themselves, that is why enough youth have suicidal thoughts because they get so pressured into thinking that them owe them parents something. Mm -hmm. You them no owe me nothing more than for be the best version of themselves. See me? But that your belief might be a different thing. Pit me and grateful. If them want grateful, them are grateful. Let's not say you did do your part. Yes. I remember them never did ask you for coming. You know? Are you going to trouble them? You know? Are you going to trouble them? Are you going to trouble them? Them come. Because nobody will be. Nobody know. You see me? A child of five years old and she had something six, seven, eight, nine. Oh. We lost Richie again. Chris, I think we will have to coordinate a continuation of the conversation with Richie considering that we're not having much luck with the internet on whichever side i'm not sure yeah um 
I think so. I, I try, I'm trying to get him back, so at least, because we are near to the wrap-up time anyway. Um, so let me see if he comes back on, so at least we can just get a final word from him. Um, and then, yeah, we probably, we definitely are going to have to try and and get him back um, another time. I'll probably do a, an offline discussion yeah he looks like he's definitely dropped off this time because i'm not seeing him in the and the, and the comments are killing me okay <laughs> <laughs> the, comments, the comments are killing me um so I, I don't know we'll try to 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 do another conversation with richie very soon we promise i really appreciate everybody who's jumped on oh. uh, make sure you follow kiwanis club page ksp friends um friends across me and and staying tuned with 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 our K Talk Live issues affecting our children Sundays and Thursdays at eight pm on IG. You phone yeah. numbers? No, no. He's looks like he's the internet definitely failed this time. So we're not gonna ask out who for phone him. I use still, but last well, no worry so no worry no worry all right so yeah it looks like we, we've definitely lost it for this evening so we're just gonna have to do a follow-up uh with okay. him and um maybe we do a longer one on youtube um where you can actually have him there but yes uh there's lots of gems that he Trust presented me. this evening and i think that we we learned a lot and I think that one of the main things that I want to take away is that if you're a father, don't forget your children. You understand? Don't forget your children. So, yes, it's definitely um, there. So um, I'm going to hand back to you, Sandrina, so we can wrap up um, for this evening. Yeah. Guys, follow us. Um, follow our IG, Friends yeah. Across B. Um, so that you know when the next one is coming so that we can definitely let you know when we get back, Richie, and tell you where we can complete this full conversation. Right. And we're here on Instagram on Thursday nights at 8 p.m., on Sunday nights at 8 p.m., talking about issues that will be that affect the children because the Kiwanis Club is here to serve the children of the world. So thanks so much for joining. Hit that follow button. All of Richie's, Richie's crew, we want you to follow us. So you can see what we're up to and how you can be a part. Thank you guys so much for your time. Thanks for keeping the comment section very live. And um, Richie calls me Sardine. I'll see if I'll change my handle to that for a little bit. And until we talk again, thank you very much for spending the time with us. Good night, everyone. Good night. Good night.